Hey guys, it's James, and today I wanted to take a look at the Coca-Cola company, the K ticker symbol KO. I wanted to check out this stock. I wanted to see how much we would need of KO to be able to obtain $1,000 a month in dividends. So I'm going to be using my single fund investing calculator, and then I'll go over to my fund versus fund calculator and compare KO with Vanguard S&P 500's growth ETF, ticker symbol VOOG. Let's go ahead and go over to Seeking Alpha and check out the data. We are looking at currently a stock price of $58. Their annual growth is about 10% over the past year. Over the past five years, it's been about 40%. And over the past 10 years, it's been a total of 67%. So this stock has continued to grow. We look at their annual dividend yield. We're looking at a 2.86% dividend yield with $1.68 paid out per share per year. What I think is really interesting with the Coca-Cola company is you take a look at their dividend history and we go over to the max and we go over to the max tab right here. We see that Coca-Cola has continue to increase their quarterly dividend all the way starting back in 1989. That's as far back as the Seeking Alpha has had the data. Now, I also want to point out that Coca-Cola Company is a collection of multiple brands. I found this graphic here on Yahoo News that looks like they pulled it from Forbes.com. They have multiple drinks in multiple categories. It might be a little fuzzy, but you kind of get the idea. If we go over to their website, we see some of the brands featured under their investor tab. I don't think this is all of the brands that they own because I believe they did buy the Monster Energy drink. If we check out their Wikipedia page. It's actually traded under MNS tea but it is owned by the coca-cola company according to wikipedia i believe they bought it in 2014 for about two billion dollars and it's generating revenue of about four and a half billion per year so definitely a profitable buy let's go over to our single fund calculator so we Put in all of the stats and I'll run through the calculator with you here. Uh, the share price is sitting at $58. The dividend yield is 2.86%. It's a stock, so there's no expense ratio. The dividend payout is quarterly. So every quarter you get about 41 cents. And remember, this is growing every quarter since 1989. The annual dividend is going to be about $1.66 per share. So let's say we put $1,000 in Coca-Cola stock with dividends reinvested. This is what we are looking at after 10 years. We are going to have about $3,500 with continued 10% growth every year. Now, if we want to be not as bullish on this stock, let's say we averaged 5% over 10 years, our $1,000 will have turned into 2100 over 10 years. Let's say we had $10,000. Basically, just go ahead and put a zero on the end. Your $10,000 will have turned into $21,000 after 10 years. Pretty impressive instead of leaving, let's say, your emergency fund in the bank, leaving your ten grand in the bank. It will have grown to $21,000. let us say you wanted to invest $1,000 in the principal and you wanted to put $50 a month in Coca-Cola. This is what the graph is going to look like after 10 years with the dividends reinvested. It's going to grow a lot faster. And then over here on our long-term graph, again, with the power of compounding interest, the more you have, the more you're going to get. And then if we come over here, this is the number that we're looking for. This is the annual dividends. If we wanted $100 a year by owning Coca-Cola stock, we would need $34 or $3,500. Here's what we would need if we wanted $500 in dividends, $1,000 in dividends, and then if we wanted $12,000 a year or $1,000 a month, we would need about $419,000. Let's go and compare this fund with VOOG. I have already put in the fund stats for VOOG as well as Coca-Cola. We have the same initial deposit. VOOG has grown fairly decently here the past year, but let's say VOOG grows another 25% over the next year, let's say we are looking into December of 2022. Let's say VOOG continues to grow at 25%. Let's go ahead and put Coca-Cola up to 10%. 
and we can see VOOG has a better growth rate. You might be looking at this graph and thinking, well, why would I ever invest in Coca-Cola even if they continued their 10% run and VOOG continued their 25% run? Why would I ever invest in Coca-Cola company? Well, it all depends on your investing strategy. We go over here and let's say you wanted a monthly dividend. You wanted a larger amount of a monthly dividend for a lower amount of investment. You can see the difference here. To be able to have $1,000 per month, it would only take $419,000 of Coca-Cola. However, it would take about $2.2 .2 million to be able to make $1,000 a month or $12,000 a year. And then if you wanted to have a salary of $50,000 a year, it would take almost four to five times as much VOOG than it would for Coca-Cola Company. If you guys want access to this calculator and you want to support the channel, head over to patreon.com at Jim the Producer and I have a few finance workbooks that you can purchase for a very low cost. The fund versus fund investing calculator which was featured in this video which is just three dollars per month. You can either purchase it and stop your subscription or you can keep up the subscription and every new version that I upload to Patreon you'll have first access to. Or if you don't want to spend any money as of yet you can download my free 401k investing calculator all you need is Microsoft Excel. And with that, please hit that like button that lets me know that you guys enjoy this type of content and subscribe to the channel if you want to see more videos like this. Thanks for watching.